What happened? Oh, well, it's really quite funny. I was, I was in bed sleeping at uh, 2 o'clock this morning. My wife comes in and says, oh, the shop's been, uh, someone ran into the shop. And I said, oh, what? So I jumped out of bed and all I had was my undies on. And I've walked out the front and I've seen uh, the car smashed and I've seen the bloke walking back to the car. And so I've walked outside and I said, oh, what are you doing, mate? Like, you can't be leaving the scene. And he goes, don't be a hero, mate. And I said, I'm not trying to be a hero, but the police are coming. And he just decided he'd scoot up the road. And I just said, nah, it's not going on like that, mate. So I jumped in my car and I started chasing him up the road. And then he went down a side street and then the police were coming. And I flashed him and sent them off in the direction of him. But, mate, all I had was my jocks on. I, I was chasing him up the street and I'm just like, mate, like... Because you, you told me that this is your mate's shop yeah. and you didn't want him to get away. Yeah, no, nah, no. Nah, it, it, well, me mate's mum's had this shop for like 40 odd years and uh, look at it. Look at it. it Whoa. It's a mess, isn't yeah, it? Beyond a mess. Oh, like words, words can't explain how it is, mate. Like now, Daniel, you managed to put some pants on in the meantime. Yeah, mate. It's like... good to hear. <laughs> do you feel like a hero? Oh. Uh, not really. It's it's just something you've got to do for the community, mate. It's like you look after your mates and your mates will always look after you. There you go. Good attitude. There you go, guys. Daniel, quite the Australian hero here this morning. As for the owners of the fish and chip shop, well, they are insured, but there is a big mess to clean up this morning. Oh, wouldn't you like to live next door to yeah, Daniel? Woo-hoo! <laughs> <laughs> the day. Uh, and, and yeah, thanks a lot. Jess, what Daniel needs to realise, Daniel, if you can hear me, you know all good superheroes wear their jocks on the outside, so True. it kind of fits the brief, yeah. pardon the pun. Yeah, oh, but no. I had nothing on but me jocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Lisa. Well, you missed that bit of the uniform, but that's OK. You're a hero in our eyes. Wow. Well done, Daniel. Yeah, cheers. Thanks a lot, guys. Goes to really? show yeah. what you can achieve in your underwear. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much, Jessica Millwood. Check in with you again shortly.